Um, today is July 30th. Misha came to the Columbus Zoo on May 24th. And I just want to give you an update on where she is and, and how, she's, how she's been doing. Um, right now she's taking a nap. She's been playing hard this morning. Today we made a visit to another one of the gorilla areas in this building. We're trying to get her acclimated to all parts of the exhibit here. Um, she was, had a chance to use one of the Lixits, uh, which is one of her water sources, and she was able to play with it and even took a little drink from it, which was exciting. Um, we've been spending a lot of time in our back area where her introduction to her surrogate mom will take place, uh, just to get her very extremely comfortable in that area. Misha has been eating solid foods just great. She will go and pick up her food and hold it herself and eat it. We're thrilled. This just uh, started within the past week or two. And she's been eating sweet potatoes and apples, foods that we're cooking at this stage because she still doesn't have all of her teeth in. Uh, Misha's teeth here, she came in with eight teeth and she's been teething, cutting teeth, and she's finally got her two upper teeth and uh, she's been working on those bottom ones. I think they're her molars and, and uh, she's been taking her bottle through the mesh. Uh, we, we have to be able to feed her after the introduction and we are training her to walk to the mesh and we have a bottle there and that's where it's offered to her. She's much more comfortable in the gorilla area. For a long time, she was more comfortable in our back night area, our hand rearing area. And now we're seeing such a comfort out next to the gorillas where she'll be living. Um, climbing on this rod, she just climbs all the time with her enrichment toys, playing, playing in the hay, napping in the hay, um, sleeping, because she will be next to her surrogate mom in a nest and uh, this is what she will be sleeping in so we've been laying her down and she's been and just extremely comfortable so we, we're just so thrilled with her progress um, just the way she moves around um, her leg doesn't seem to give her any problems at all she, the way she's moving and climbing she's fast and she's just adapted to having one leg uh, beautifully. She's out here right now by the people, and, and that's important too that we have her in this area so she can be used to the zoo visitors because they will be on the other side of the glass too when she's with her surrogate mom. Um, everything we've been working on with Misha, she's just doing great, and we know that the introduction to her surrogate mom, we're, we're spending more and more time with her in the back next to her and with her family, and we're expecting an introduction in the near future.